Hello, everyone. We're going to have some uh, sound issues as we get started. How's it going? So, believe it or not, I've never played Darkest Dungeon. Well, okay, I take that back. I've played about an hour of Darkest Dungeon, and uh, this game like really stressed the hell out of me. And I mentioned that on stream a while back, so uh, Mr. Blackjack bought it for me. Or he bought Crimson Court. I already own Darkest Dungeon. <laughs> he bought me the Crimson Court expansion pack and wants to see me suffer. So, completely blind run in Darkest Dungeon. I don't know anything about the game. I watched a little bit of Bear Taffy play, but he played way back in the beginning. And uh, uh, it was balanced such that he never brought torches. And that's all I remember. <laughs> all right. Hey, Mr. Paradox, how's it going? So, let's just have everything. The flagellant. Districts, upgrade, Crimson Court. All right, sure. I've heard some complaints about Crimson Court, about how it's too grindy, but I have I have no idea. We're going to call this uh, the Craven Poet Estate. All right, let's go. <laughs> no, I don't get angry over games. Unless it's Xenonauts. I get angry over that game. <laughs> hey, Sir Dialad, how's it going? And, and this is full of coffee, by the way. It's the kind of day it is. You will arrive along the old road. It winds with a troubling serpent-like suggestion through the corrupted countryside. Leading only, I fear, <laughs> oh, sorry, to sorry, sir, tenebrous places. There is a sickness in the ancient pitted cobbles of the old road, and on its writhing path, you will face viciousness, violence, and perhaps other damnably transcendent terrors. So steel yourself, and remember there can be no bravery without madness. The old road will take you to hell, but in that gaping abyss, we will find our redemption. Dun, dun, dun. So for most people, uh, as this game has been wildly popular for the last two years, uh, there's going to be nothing new here. Just a guy who doesn't know what he's doing. With the stagecoach destroyed and the caretaker gone, you will have to make the journey to the hamlet on foot. All right. You're currently in a room. To move, click on another room and the map is playing. I'll take you to the connecting hallway. Sure. Brigands have run up these lanes. Keep to the side path. The hamlet is just ahead. <laughs> awesome, Sir Dialot. Yeah, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to, uh, if you look at my schedule down below, we're going to be doing uh, XCOM separated by something else. So people who can't watch the stream will have a day to watch the YouTube video if they want to try to keep up. It'll be a lot easier this way. And then we won't uh, run in with uh, overrun Nook's XCOM stream on Tuesdays either, either way. So it'll be Monday, Wednesday, Friday, XCOM. Wednesday is always an optional stream day. And then Tuesday and Thursday will be our other game, which right now will be Darkest Dungeon. D forward, A back. Dispatch this thug in brutal fashion that all may hear of your arrival. And if you want more background noise, let me know. I right, kill the enemy. Combat is turn based. And here is turn. Click a skill icon and click on the target. You can't block your skill. That's because a hero needs to be standing in a different spot where there are no valid targets. That I am aware of. Six and six to twelve. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Can do that. Loot each item. If you take it, will occupy space in your inventory. Whole fifty gold. Rich. How's that for sound? Interactive objects. While exploring, you will often find interactive objects. Click or press W to investigate them. Take a look at this tent. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. 
Leave nothing unchecked. There is much to be found in forgotten places. Do 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 do. An ambush. Send these vermin a message. The rightful owner has returned, and their kind is no longer welcome. Uh, hundred base, fifty. I'll take a chance. Oh, my face. <laughs> that one hurts. Well, let's keep bleeding you. I could do everything from back here. Well, there's a chance I can kill him. Well, maybe with that bleed. There we go. Prodigious size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. Oh. Mortality clarified in a single strike. So this game just makes me nervous. I don't know what it is why this does it and XCOM doesn't. Got an eye patch, Remind man at arms, gold. Slow and insidious killer. After you completed the requirements of a quest, you have the option to return to town at any time. Just click the crest. You don't need to return to the starting room of the dungeon to exit. Now, uh, let's open the chest. Something doesn't look quite right. Oh, well. We got the blight. I don't have any experience with Darkest Dungeon, other than watching uh, a little bit of Bear Taffy and a little bit of uh, the Brian. Auto automatanophobia. Auto auto automatanophobia. Plus 20 stress versus humans and Warren Scrounger. Welcome home, such as it is. This squalid hamlet, these corrupted lands, they are yours now. A lot of goals. And you are bound to them. <laughs> A lot of goals. All right. Congratulations, everyone. Made it to town. On any screen in the game, you can press and hold H so you can textual help for controls in that mode. Try it while in town. Exploring, fighting, camping, and more. Right-click on a hero to inspect their character sheet. Click on stuff. All right. I know what the buildings do. Stagecoach. Women and men, soldiers and outlaws, fools and corpses. You'll need to recruit oh, all of these heroes to fill out a party of four. The road is clear. Drag and drop them to your roster. Grand Court and what Bassett. Than the blood Bassett. Upgrade the stagecoach. While you're here, spend of your starting hero on upgrading the stagecoach network. This will increase the number of heroes available in the future. Okay, while we're here, we'll do that. Let's do both. Word is traveling. Ambition is stirring in distant cities. <laughs> we can use this. Ancestors' memoirs. In time, you will know the tragic extent of my Oh, I didn't failings. see the first video. We'll do that one. Ruin has come to our family. You remember our venerable house? Opulent and imperial gazing proudly from its stoic perch above the moor. I lived <laughs> all my years in that ancient, rumor-shadowed manor, fattened by decadence and luxury. And yet I began to tire of conventional extravagance. Singular unsettling tales suggested the mansion itself was a gateway to some fabulous and unnameable power. With relic and ritual, I bent every effort towards the excavation and recovery of those long buried secrets. But why? Exhausting hey, whoa, how's it going? Our family fortune on swarthy workmen and sturdy shovels. At last, in the salt soaked crags beneath the lowest foundations, we unearthed that damnable portal and to deluvian evil.
I really want to get his audiobooks, but they're... Our every step unsettled the ancient earth. But we were in a realm of death and madness. In the end, I alone fled laughing and wailing through those blackened arcades of antiquity. They're very expensive for Until the time. consciousness failed me. You remember our venerable house. Opulent and imperial. It is a festering abomination. I beg you, return home, claim your birthright, and deliver our family from the ravenous clutching shadows of the darkest dungeon. Love that font. All right. Videos up. There isn't much more you can do in town right now. It's time to embark on a quest. Oh, boy, I still got the graveyard. Most will end up here. Excellent. Covered in the poisoned earth. No deaths on the first run. Oblivion. A mecca quest and parties. And morbidity. This is where you. <laughs> <laughs> this is where you select a quest and form an adventuring party of four heroes to embark on it. <laughs> Unwavered in his quest, he wished to find the Forgotten Land to write tales of lore and merriment of adventure. The birthright would be his claim in doing so in its treasures. I like the passive voice of that. Alright. Just pop over there. The usual suspects. Alright. We got... I think the only thing we got was... For the man-at-arms. Test yourself in the mad realm of your fallen ancestor. Take note of how the creatures have taken over, but don't delve too far. Explore 90% of the rooms. Provision. So what's the general rule of thumb? Measured now in gold. One stack of torches per size? In blood. I have no idea what I need. One key. One key's good. Two shovels. Never a clue. We don't get to keep any of this, right? Laudanum. Alright. We'll do one stack of torches. Stun resist is first. Decision. I don't think these guys bleed. <laughs> no, they do not. The razzle dazzle. Can we stun lock? Oh wait, no, they get a stun buff, don't they? That's not that big. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. When most monsters die, they leave corpses. Corpses act as temporary obstacles and will eventually go away on their own. You can attack corpses to destroy them faster, but often a better approach is to use rain skills, push and pull skills, or even corpse clearing special skills that some heroes possess. Monsters killed with bleed, blight, or crits leave no corpses at all. is broken. Maintain the offensive. Like that. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles, paid for in blood. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Oh, I didn't use a shovel. I thought it was in there. 
Didn't I? Yeah. Skeleton, skeleton, skeleton. <laughs> Not so accurate, are we? Ah, gotcha. The light is fading. The current torch level greatly affects many mechanics in the game. The darker it gets, the harder things get, but the better the rewards. Such a terrible assault yeah, cannot sir. be left unanswered. Oh, we can blight them, can't we? No, it's still the last two. Kill that one. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. So critical kills. Damage mod is low, low, low. Maybe it's the small scale of hit points that worries me. Oh, there's a good chance we can kill him. Nope. <laughs> no chance at all. Oh, okay, good to know. Ah, yes. Retreat from battle. Onslaught. Destroy them all. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. It's always stress management. That's what this is all about, right? Now we'll go around. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted, and purpose is made clear. Sure. Nothing I can bring back with me, though. All the bleeds. Never mind. <laughs> Our stress is getting up there. What's your stun? I'll give it a shot. right now accuracy is the most important thing right I'll try to keep oh you just want so let's take you out oh man you need wood to make camp right <laughs> how's it going I have a promise I do it been sitting there on the backlog just mocking me for a long time. Kind of light. What does that do? Minus accuracy. Torch 
Torch plus 20, no. Another abomination cleansed from all <laughs> Wood thing. I'm good with wood things. <laughs> Oh, nice. Yes, yeah, so this includes Crimson Court. Lovingly brought to you uh, by Mr. Paradox. Let's get a heal in. Yeah, he's good on stress. Nope. 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 That yeah, might as well. Do it. Duh. The blood. The blood is a special type of supply item. Any collected bottles of the blood will be retained in your estate at quest end. They may be added to the provisions of embarking parties. The blood is rare. Spread it around wisely among those in need. That's a crimson court thing, isn't it? Look at all these torches, man. The chest with your family sigil. Money. Oh, I didn't see it. Ancient traps lie in wait, unsprung and thirsting for blood. All right, well, I guess we just do those two. That should be 90%, right? Fortune. Did you just get like kleptomaniac right back. off the bat? <laughs> yeah, seriously? Oh man. Where did that come from? Alright, eat the food. <laughs> a dear crusader all right to the last one all right shovel in there With oh the I had to click the iron, shovel you must rely on flesh never mind and indefatigable purpose <laughs> there you go Oh, it's bound to happen. Afflicted. When heroes can't take the stress anymore, they become afflicted. This manifests in different behaviors and stat changes. Afflictions last until you send them to treatment in town, unless you can reduce their stress to zero during the quest. No, that was totally my fault. Oh, lovely. Oh, that helps. Stun or Blight? Probably Stun. Excellent. Nice hit, though. Yay, full stun. I like that. Who's the guy with the repose skill? I remember that looking very effective. 
Okay, let's take care of him. All I can think of is a uh, <laughs> nice hit. What is the masochistic guy from Valkyrie Chronicles? He made it entertaining. A 10. Smite plus 15% damage versus holy. Well, there's a good chance. Another yes. one falls. Well, might as well try. Nice. Where's his blight? Four, so he's dead no matter what we do. Thanks, buddy. Should be able to hit that guy. No, no, never mind. Still dead. It's <laughs> dick. those uh you know we got space so let's let's walk back and we got torches right and food yeah we're good worst case scenario we'll just run run like chickens i don't think we're in heart attack territory yet Give me something. Ambushed by foul invention. Hey, that looks like fun. the shot, right? Nine and ten chances done. <laughs> Did not expect that. Alright, what do I do with that well? I'm liking these damage rolls. <laughs> Except for you, you're not helping. Not one bit. Alright. 
Oh, that was totally worth it. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. An ornate fountain of holy purport. Well, that sounds good for you, right? Eh, not useful. Oh, they were both masochistic. Nice. Minus one speed. Warren Scrounger. I think we have two Warren Scroungers next. And a Photomania. Minus 20% stretch, stress of torch above 75. I feel like I'm going to be living in the high torch light right now. Over time, some negative forks. That must be destroyed will lock into place and become severe. Severe negative quirks cost much more money to remove in the Sanctum. Alright, Tavern's unlocked and the Abbey is now unlocked. Fresh kegs, cards, and curtained rooms promise solace to the weary and broken alike. Heroes relieve stress by taking part in activities at the Tavern and Abbey. Each activity has different side effects. Experiment to find the best activity for each hero depending on their quirks. Committing a hero to an activity locks them in that activity, in that activity until the next week. They'll have to take a different hero with you on your next quest. All right. Before we do that, as much as I want to put those in there, we need to see what else we get. The cobwebs have been dusted. The pews set straight. The abbey calls to the faithful. All right. Well, let's see what we got. Well, let's get this occultist. To fight the abyss, one must know it. Well, I guess we need another crusader, since he'll be a going away. Sword arm anchored by holy purpose, a zealous warrior. All right, and we can't do any of those yet. God for time will only pray for stress for relief. Well, that will go ahead and take care of that for you. I don't remember you having that last time I looked at her. <laughs> Bassett. Slow reflexes and torn rotator. Well, that's not so bad for you. We can let that fix in there. Mankind hater. All right, I'll bring you to the bar. All right, that is it for now. Should I grab another witch doctor while I have him? Or uh, another plague doctor? Doesn't really cost me anything, does it? What better laboratory than the blood-soaked battlefield? What does that mean? Clear a path to the boss. Progress 0%. Let's grab Lulier and a Linam. Mix bag. <laughs> And we got plus 10% blight skill chance. I'll give that to you, I guess. Grave robber only, don't have any of those. Highwayman only, I'll grab that. Probably. Room battles. Jester, Solar Crown. I think you can. Yeah, you can rename heroes. Uh, let's see, Solar Crown or plus four dot. I like that. Oh, recolor. 
You get four options. Nice. I feel like it's like naming your child before they get through their first case of measles. It's just a waste of time. Alright. There we go. Well, let's grab a stack of food and torches. That worked well for that small. Two, one. Combat debuffs, sure. We got holy water and we have an anti venom. Alright. I guess we go. <laughs> I guess. Once holy idols and shrines have been corrupted to favor pagan gods, holy water can help restore them to their rightful condition. The fiends must be driven back. And what better place to begin than the seat of our noble line? Right click on a hero's image or portrait at any time to bring up a detailed panel showing all their quirk skills and resistances that we know. All right. Let's go this way first. I'll take it. Man, Torchlight goes down so fast. I guess that's the point. Alright. Start with that stress right away, huh? Uh, healing. And debuff target. Vulnerability hex. And demon pull. Clear all corpses. Pull two. You're not going to bleed. Alright, we got you the plague upgrade. So that will kill them all. If we do nothing else. Your hero is bleeding. If you wish, you can use a bandage from inventory to stop the flow. Right click on the bandage. So, do I just heal them now, or do I wait until it gets bad? <laughs> Inspiring cry. No. Oh, we didn't have that before. Alright, we have Smite. A zealous accusation. Uh, Alright. It does heal one. He's a plague doctor. They wear the masks, because they help protect him from the plague. We'll Smite. Oh, you're dead. So, to bring you down. Oh, is it a she? Oh, so much stress already. Oh, I see. I should have grabbed that other Plague Doctor and swapped her out. That would have been smart, huh? <laughs> that would have been really smart. Alright. These are all back, aren't they? Alright, let's give you a heal. Come on, no bleed. Nice. Unnerved. Unbalanced. Ooh, that worked out nicely. <laughs> Sometimes heroes respond to the onslaught of stress by becoming heroic. This elevated state of performance will last until they camp or return to town and confer stat bonuses and other benefits. What do we got? Just vigorous. Doesn't tell me. I have a slight problem with games that make you look in the wiki for answers. Uh, three to five. They'll do really good if we can hit. Oh, uh, perfect. Give them no quarter. A little stun. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Oh, we're gonna do well for stress on this one. Can I heal only in the back row, but we'll heal you.
Boon, spoon, 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 spoon. I don't see it. Surges as the enemy crumbles. It seems to be working out well for us, though. Oh, nice. How did you get nine on that? Oh, it was zero to thirteen heal. I thought it was zero to three. Uh, you're dead next turn, so let's momentary abatement. Stress down. Anyone need it? No, you're done bleeding. Oh, I can heal everyone with that. That was... Okay, so I love Stardew Valley, but that is also one of my gripes with Stardew Valley. I had downloaded a mod to... be able to, like, shift-click everything in that game to figure out, like, everyone... who likes what and stuff like that. Two eye patches. Look at us. We're gonna have a blind man at arms. Just wear them both. And that was just the first battle. Vigorous. Yes. Medicinal herbs, gold, and a journal page. Alright. What are these for? Blackest of Fates. I will return with Cuthbert's banner and Bolin's crossbow so as to honor them with a proper burial. I will leave what is left of their thrice damned Mizir and his trinket to the swine folk. Perhaps they will build him the memorial he rightly deserves. Occasionally on their turn, heal a small amount of health. This combined with increased speed boost, boosts the survival chance dramatically. Immune stress damage from Bolin's. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> That's great. I'm cool with that. No, oh, it's like the same one again, but we got surprised. All right. Keep that guy stunned and I think I'll be happy. All the dodge. Yeah, you can't stress her. <laughs> stress her all you want. That is great. I'm gonna keep pulling you forward. <laughs> Lymphatic lands. <laughs> I'm gonna keep grape shotting you. Take this one out. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Aww. That's fine. In the little bit I played, I really like the grave robber. All right, you're all buffed up, so let's go ahead and kill this guy. You have a 66% chance. Oh, and you missed. Let's give you a heal. No bleed. Nice. Yeah, this is definitely excellent. Here, kill that one. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Haha! <laughs> Can't stress me. You kind of, oh, I can do this one. Yeah, clear all corpses.
Excellent. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I like the uh, I like the whole movement part of this a lot. You don't have any. All right, why not? Let's see what this does. Good enough. What do you got? You will die if we don't do anything. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task the chest. end. Daw. Yes, it is. I don't think there's a way to actually save the game. Alright. You either get back to town, or <laughs> well, whether or not you get back to town, you wind up back in town. So where do the trap notifications pop up? We've hit like two of them. Like should I have him selected by default as the highwayman or rogue? Oops. Oh. Confession booth. Forsaken confession booth, it hasn't been used in years. Do I just use it? You know, you got... Who has the worst stuff, just in case this works? Yep, God fearing's fine. No cheat. Uh, that's fine. <laughs> need to do specific actions. Alright, we're gonna give it to you. <laughs> no stress, that's fine. <laughs> oh no, we got maggots. So what do we do? Oh my god, six hit points? Uh, we could mostly kill all of them. Does that have to, uh, only do one damage? I only hit one, I mean. That's fine. We'll do the back row while we're here. Daw. <laughs> Little maggots not on your toes. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. What's in the box? Absolutely nothing. Oh, I like these surprises. Oh. <laughs> That's a shitty resist. Not quite dead yet. Well, let's just resist all the things, shall we? Of damage to me. I resist everything. <laughs> oh, the cultist does not want to have any debuffs. Never mind. 
let's uh, stop spreading out damage. Wait, no, let's spread out damage one more time. <laughs> Alright. Let's give you a plague. Precision and power. That'll kill you. Minus 30% damage. Well, you're dead, and I assume you're going to be dead, so let's give a little heal up. I'm so glad they're focusing on him, too, for that. No bleed. Excellent. Damn it. Slowly. Gently. This is how a life is taken. There we go. These nightmarish creatures can and we be got felt. junk. They can be beaten. All right. Unfortunately, no one can wear that to fear of space. Well, we've had a battle in every room so far. A stack of books, a stack of literary treasures in an unlikely location. What's the worst that could happen? Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles, mm -hmm. paid for in blood. Here, take that. This one is... Blood-soaked pages torn from a journal. My fears were confirmed. With our torch doused by an errant spray of seawater, we were ambushed. Strange fish-like hominids ambushed us in the sudden darkness. The pitch of the torch caught quickly, and I glimpsed scaly appendages swinging crude weapons, glistening and barbed. It didn't last long with our torch rekindled. Alas, one bit of me, one bit me on the neck before I gutted it. The wound stings and tingles strangely. Our physic told me to keep it clean and covered. <laughs> Knock on wood. A bookshelf. Sure. Uh oh. Torn rotator. What do you got? Minus five damage. Oh, that's a bad one for you. Let's kill the spider first. Stun and blight. HP seven. If I can get a plague on you, you will die. Nice. No, not quite. Alright, now you'll die. Executed with impunity. Back to the pit. Lawless. Ghoulish horrors. Brought low and driven into the mud. Hey, we finally got a scout. Oh, and we can see. Nice, excellent. Trap. Oh, there it is here. Why don't you disarm the trap? Sweet. Bag of stuff. A fortune waiting to be spent. 375. Shift click. There we go. Double loot. A handsome reward for a task well performed. No one torch left. All right, do our standard. Meh. <laughs> Meh.
friend for the old gods. Oh, we can actually see what they start to do once they start doing it. That's cool. Kill Wolverine first. 15, 15. But I can, like, kill this guy in one hit if I'm lucky. But I am not. I am not. fix that. Surgical precision. <laughs> Surgical literally. Alright, 8, 8, 11. Let's go ahead and get you bleeding. Bleed, bleed. Yes. Alright, you're dead. Critical but low on the low end. And it caused a bleed. Wasn't very wasn't very critical. You're fine. Push me all you want, I got a pistol. That's a better heal. Ah, oh, another bleed. Right. Now we'll just stab you. You're good on health. Oh man. We are losing out on all this bleed stuff. Alright, you're dead, so let's get some stress down. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Hmm. I have one torch left. Well, let's go ahead and use it. In radiance, may we find victory. All right, let's do one more room while we have light. Sarcophagus. I don't want sarcophagus. It is slightly ajar. Oh, if only I had. <laughs> if only I had. What does the shovel do? All right. Sweet. Oh, I get a scout too. Yeah, no battle, no one curio. Scouted traps will be visible on the ground as you approach them. Select a hero and then click on the trap to disarm it. Okay, so we have to scout him out first. That makes sense. Locked display cabinet. I got a key. And done. Room by room, hall by hall, we reclaim what is ours. All right, what do we get? Hey, we got levels. Dismas got anemic, bleed resist, and scouting chance and wheel. I thought we already had that for you. Dark Temptation, prone to investigating the dark arts. Thanatophobia, plus 20% stress of HP below 50%, and no stress penalty when walking backwards. Not really useful if only one person has it, is it? Though long years may seek to separate them, action and consequence will invariably have their dreadful reunion. Before it. Alright. 
Intolerable. Clouds of mosquitoes and other less identifiable pests continue to descend upon the hamlet with maddening persistence. Illness and irritation abound. All right. We fixed our masochism. Oh. Give me a trinket as a gift. We got the archer's ring. The blacksmith is unlocked, and as is the guild. All right, I think Grand Court needs to go and take a rest. Compulsive. May not meditate. You lucked out there, Grand Court. Anyone else really need it? Well, let's see what we got in the stagecoach. Oh, we have a man at... Oh, nice. Let's get you. Tortured and reclusive. This man is more dangerous than he seems. And by God. And for now, I guess we can give Dismas a break. I think we have enough. The bellows blast once again. The forge stands ready to make weapons of war. Well, those weapon rank upgrades. Two, armor, furnace. Actually, they cost so. I'll bring you out again. What is that symbol? sharper sword a stronger shield okay anything to prolong a soldier's life before we do that go to the guild make no mistake we will face ever greater threats we can Our reduce the cost of training not like that every creature has a weakness the wise hero trains for what he will face Anyone ever use Mace Bash? <laughs> Heal 3 HP. Kind of like that better than the Dazzling Light. Although the stun is nice. Illumination. Minus dodge. And the light. Alright. What else? We got the Archer's Ring. Plus 5 accuracy range skills. And something for Dismas. Do I want to go in there? <laughs> Do I really want to? All right, we got some cash, though. All right, we can take man-at-arms. You're front line, right? All right, you're like number two. All right, second position. Unless you are transformed. What do you have? All the buffs and one crush. Retribution. I want retribution out of you, don't I? It's by default. Alright. Buy that for sure. Here, we're going to have four active combat skills at a time. Toggle the skills on and off to change your loadout. All right, knockback and stun, also very nice. And bellow, that's a debuff. I'll go with those. Now right, we're gonna bring it one, two. Now we'll bring uh, Linum again. Oops, guild first. Abyssal Artillery, plus 50 damage from Mrs. Eldritch, and from the Abyss. Oh, that's a nice stun. Torch minus 5. A sacrificial Stab. 
That's a nice crit bonus. We'll keep with what you got right now. Let's get some weapons with the guys we're going to bring. Didn't I do that? Oh, hero resolve level. All right, never mind. We'll bring you for sure, though. Get ourselves a better candle. <laughs> the bigger candle. Oh, we'll leave Dismas behind. I guess we'll bring the other guy. We'll bring you. That'll work. In time, you will know the tragic extent of do my do failings. New courtyard quest available. Short apprentice level one. Well, this looks this looks wonderful. <laughs> Let's go right into it. And we'll bring the new one. The grind house. Your name is Ram Becourt. Rainbow Court. Rainbow Court. Rainbow Court. He's a Rainbow Court. Lockhard. By God. And Linum. Alright, let's give it a shot. Gold activates three thronging hives. And longer than usual. Level one or two healers are recommended. Alright, let's uh let wait till the level one then. I think we have do we have any wield bonuses on this? Buff target. Buff target. We'll do that. Warrior of Light. Hard skinned. Alright. And Archer. This is all range stuff, right? So we'll give you that. Plus four dodge. I can go plus. <laughs> I can't wear two white patches. Aw. Alright. What do we got available? Arbalist only. We don't have one of those yet. Rot gut sensor. Oh, that's nice. All right, we'll do that one then. Take a full one, a full one. All right. Let us go. The ruins bear all the signs of her ancestors' friends, frenzied digging. Pace out the halls of your lineage once familiar. Now, Boren. Bah. We have to go this way. Can I change this order? If I go... Like... <laughs> does that move it down one? It does. Excellent. We'll go this way first. Free stuff. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. A trampled journal. Huel, dear friend, exemplary warrior, and survivor of the King's Wars, and many sorties in these halls have met an ignoble end. We were wary. Huel and I, as we search for sanctuary. Weariness, it appears, has a murderous streak. It blinded him to the mechanism that tripped the spikes which eviscerated him. I held him as his essence slipped away. Another giant fallen in our mad pursuit. I am alone now, wary, but unbowed. I press on. Speaking of... Ancient traps lie in wait. Unsprung and thirsting for blood. Excellent. Free rooms to scout. 
Uh, is there... Can I see their trap? Aha. Not you. Definitely not you. <laughs> we got... All right, we're all going to take damage from traps, aren't we? I'll, I'll let the occultists do this one. Not bad. Decorative urn. An urn holds the ashes of the departed. Let's try that. Nice. Urn holy water. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. There you, go. you click the shovel. That's how you do it. All right, that was a free hallway, basically. Just a waste of torches. And so we go. Oh, new combat. That was something to do. Excellent. And they are all lovely, bleedable people. Stone, 100%. No damage, though. More likely to blight them. Alright, well, he's technically dead. Another stun. Can I kill him? Else to transform. No damage. All right. So it is. Stab, stab. Kill that one. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Well, you haven't moved yet. Who has the most damage? You. All right, you're dead. Poor heal. Yes, we didn't get the bleed. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Free food. <laughs> it kind of does, doesn't it? It's going to make the oh uh, noise. Oh, the trap. Is that the trap disarm skill? Yeah. Oh, trap disarm 60%. Okay. That's why it's doing so well. <laughs> <Arr! laughs> Alright, this is an explorer one. So... 
Eight rooms. I don't remember what was in here. Lock display cabinet. We'll do an unlock. A handsome reward. Yeah. For a task well performed. Money's really important right now, isn't it? Oh, this is a nice and easy. Give me a nice stun. <laughs> I have a zombie infestation coming up next in X Fire in uh, XCOM files when I was doing the new uh, the new banner picture. I let it run, and that's what popped up next. Oh, let's get a heal in. Nice. Not when I need it, but hey. Oh well. You are missing. Oh, you don't have the knife. I like that knife a lot. Are they resistant to blight? No, I should have blighted that guy, huh? Back to the pit. I like the man at arms. This like him a lot. At least promises success. What is that guy? A madman. I don't know what you do. Alright, no, you're not that bad. Let us... Yeah, that looks like a good course of action. This guy right here? Will do. <laughs> I'll make sure they all die, how about that? <laughs> oh, well that's shitty. All right, you suck. Let's do that again. Let's double up that blight. There we go. You're dead. You're dead next turn. Four damage. You're dead in two turns. And you're stunned, so we'll... And you're dead. So, you it is. Alright. You can't do anything else. Let's go ahead and... What's your dodge? Why not? No dodge for you. No dodge anyway, so let's drop your damage.
Eh, no need. Do a little trickle healing. I'm gonna go ahead and wait a turn, get another heal in. Oh, that buffs everyone. Alright, nice. Oh, we gotta bleed. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Oh, what are those? Plague Doctor only. Plus 40% disease resist. Oh, I'll go ahead and take that right now. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Alright, we got food to eat if we run out of space. Oh, that was fast. Oh, two guys I don't like in the back. Step, step. I think everyone's blighted now. Oh, that worked out well for you. You're dead. And... If I do one more blight... Oh, he's dead. You know, let's keep him busy. Perfect. Alright, then it's just you. Oh, he dodged the dodge debuff. How dare you. No. The knife in the dark doesn't seem to be very effective whatsoever. Alright, you're dead. You're dead. I can't kill the guy in the back? No, I can't. The blood quickens. Welcome to the front row. Oh, nice. Even through the buff. Alright, we'll get... No, I don't have a healed, so we'll go ahead and kill you. Seize Got this ourselves momentum. a shovel. Push on to the task's end. Onward. They're already in a hallway. Alright, confessions. Weak grip on life. That's probably a bad one. Obsessed with food. You know what? I don't like any of those. Can we get rid of your confessions? Nope. <laughs> no, we cannot. Is that, is that how that works? Is that an option? I need to... I don't know if I should look those up in the wiki or just, like, go with it. I don't think I'll ever remember them. torch well last room now we got torches and food though so we'll, we'll check out 
Oh, are we? Did you just get a kleptomania too? What is up with that? Oh, maybe not. Oh, curious. I think I do this. That looks familiar. <laughs> Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles. I remember that much. Pour in blood. All right, and these two guys. Grievous injury. Ah, oh, but he came to the front row, so that's nice. Those are the guys I want to stun, anyways. Leave my occultist alone. Now I want to keep you guys stunned. Let's get a healing. Only 20. Ah, you're dead. So... Let's get damage on this guy. Keep going. Because your blight is awesome. Transform you. I want to see it. What are my options now? Slam. Knockback. Minus dodge. Damage. Oh, nice. dead. You will be dead. Let's kill you. Right, you're dead. No one's left but that guy. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. The we'll give you a heal if we can. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Yeah, I'll try to heal him for you. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. And it's done. Damn it. Oh well. Try again. Book of Relaxation. Creatures Minus 10 stress. Oh, that's can be beaten. not bad. Who has no dodge anyways? <laughs> Who has the worst dodge? Alright, let's see. Can't I go side to side? We're going to check out that last room. We got torches and food, don't we? No, we're out of torches, but we got food. Done. 
17. Who needs accuracy? Give it to you. Nah, at least got a cure to get. Works for me. Just a torch. All right. The great ruins belong to us. That is perfect timing. Find whatever secrets they hold. Oh, plague doctor. All right, everyone's level one now. Wield phobe. Stress faster. That's nice, though. How up and walk to be below 50 by the time we're hungry. Fear of Eldritch stinks. No ruminator. I don't like that one at all. I like that. And Cove Tactician. A fresh irritant to some. A crumbling a stone entered a forgotten labyrinth and garden has been uncovered. The discoverer, sadly, has perished from innumerable insects sting as concern arises. All right. Trinkets and charms gathered from all the forgotten corners of the earth. Oh, that's a nice one. No mad wagon. I don't. We don't have the money to spend on that yet, do we? Let's go ahead. Ooh, a bounty hunter. Definitely take you. The thrill of the hunt. The I have two of those. Let's, might as well grab two of you for now. The sanitarium is most often used to remove negative quirks and treat diseases, but you can also use it to reinforce a positive quirk, which will lock it into place and prevent new positive quirks from displacing it. You can lock three perks per hero. All right. So you had, who had a really shitty one? I don't care about that one. Like, Kleptomaniac, right? How much would that cost to remove Kleptomania? Can I do both, or just one? Is it both? Uh, I can't afford 9,000. And Survivalist. At home in wild places, she is a stalwart survivor. We haven't really done. And a done. strict instructor. Any camping yet, have we? Yeah, stand tall, minus stress, minus 25 stress. Not yet. All right, this is a good place to stop. It's three o'clock and she'll be waking up. Uh, the schedule is tomorrow will be XCOM files. So as I said in the beginning, if you missed it, right now it'll be Monday, Wednesday, Friday will be our XCOM game. Uh, Wednesdays are always iffy. And then Tuesday and Thursday will be Darkest Dungeon. That way, if you're like watching YouTube and Twitch, you'll have time to catch up due to the 24-hour delay. Otherwise, thank you very much for watching. I feel less stressed playing this now than I did before. Maybe that's pirates. <laughs> pirates stress me out to the extreme. And uh, now nothing else can hurt me. So thank you all for watching very much. And we will see you tomorrow, 9 p.m. Uh, Central. If you scroll down to the page, the actual schedule should update to your time zone for the specific games. So thanks again, and I will catch you later.